Okay, so this gentleman has some kind of gallbladder lesion, thickening of the gallbladder wall or something. We'll take a look at that. So he's sentir le souffle dans la bouche. Respirez bien. Voilà. All right. Have a little school. Encore un petit coup. So a big balloon, just ha try to get them to put their head forward and swallow. Have a little bit school. There, merci. Okay. So, there's his liver, twerking, pancreas, uh, portal vein here. So there's the pancreatic duct at the confluence there. Looks like he has pretty good chronic pan out to the tail. Let's look at the head if we can to some extent. So the head is down here under SMV. You can sort of see it there. Can we see his gallbladder from the stomach? Uh, again, he's kind of high up here. Can we unlock this again, please? Bring him over here. Okay, thank you. So if I can just look around here in the antrum. Uh, there's something going on here that doesn't look very healthy. Okay, I think we'll see that better from the bulb, probably. That looks very strange, actually. What is that? Okay, so let's go on the bulb. There's this pylorus on the side there. Okay, into the bulb here. Apex, so gallbladder, you kind of go up. You may as well just start, just like you were doing the bottom, go up, find the portal vein, which is probably here. Then just sort of torque, I mean, I'll tell you right now, his, his bottom is right there. Following it up into the hilum. And it feels very rigid here, like something is probably sort of invading the hilum. Going up, 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 up here. Putting in some air, uh, some water in the balloon, sorry. And tip down, wow. Okay, well, what's going on here? There's this. Okay, there we go. There's the bile duct again, right here. So if you keep going left, you should eventually hit the gallbladder. Uh, wow, uh, there's, okay, there's something going on right here. I'm thickening here. I'm putting up the balloon really big. Yeah, here we go. So there's something very abnormal right here. Some fluid in it and wow, that looks really abnormal. The problem here is that, you know, wh wh where would you, yeah, this, this has to be some kind of gallbladder. Either it's, it's just a uh, empyema or, you know, cholecystitis or it's a malignancy. The problem is I hesitate to needle into the gallbladder. I think this guy's on Plavix as well. And I, you know, it's funny, I don't, I, but despite all this, I don't see like a lot of nodes or anything either, you know? Wow, this is very abnormal. I, I, I wouldn't mind this needling like the wall here. You don't want to go into the gallbladder, but just the wall thickening. But ideally you want to find a node or something you can do instead. This is extremely abnormal. Okay, let me take one more look at this gallbladder and decide if it's malignant or not. But I find, uh, d you know, distinguishing, just diagnosing gallbladder cancer, cancer, cancer in general is difficult, at least for me it is. And, um, you, know, you know, distinguishing thickening gallbladder walls from, unless there's an obvious, you know, mass with nodes everywhere and, and if they have jaundice and the whole bit. But just to thicken gallbladder, you really, to me, it's hard to distinguish that from, from cancer, uh, from uh, cholecystitis, just simply inflammatory. And I say what's, what's suggested, it's sort of not malignant here, is that I'm not really seeing any nodes. There we 
we go. There we go. Well, I think, I wonder if they could do like a laparoscopy and just look, if that's of any value, you know, there's a, but it looks like it's infiltrating into the liver there. But see, there's, like it's moving, like there's fluid. See, that's what's weird, it's not all solid. There's like a lot of fluid kind of moving around there. <laughs>